It is really a medical miracle. A Columbus man who was blind can see again tonight thanks to the skill and determination of a local surgeon. He performed an iris transplant, something that has only been done eight times before in the entire country. Matima Davis has become something of an expert on the eye. He's no longer blind, thanks to some breakthrough surgery. Last spring, he was working at Port Columbus Airport, transporting mulch when he was blinded in an accident. There's a tarp that comes down over the mulch to keep it from flying out. And I was just trying to tie the tarp up, and I pulled the bungee string, the bungee strap right under the back of the truck, and I turned around to back myself up out of the back of the truck, and it just snapped back and hit me right in the eye. Dr. Richard Erty of Mount Carmel East Hospital saved Matima's eye, but he still couldn't see. He'd lost the cornea, the clear lens that does the focusing, and the iris. That's the colored ring that opens and closes the pupil in response to light. Doctors can transplant corneas, but not irises. If we were not to do that, he would have a very large hole, which is too big and allows too much light to enter the eye and would make him light sensitive in almost every ambient light situation. Dr. Erdi had heard that researchers in the Netherlands were working on an artificial iris, and he wanted one for Matima. It was a special device that we had to obtain compassionate use approval from the Food and Drug Administration. It took six months. When the approval finally came, Dr. Erdi operated while Matima's mother and fiance watched. We hope to see him to have a visual result in the 2030, 2040 level. Less than a week later, Matima's back in Dr. Erdi's office for a checkup. He's already getting his vision back and soon will get a colored contact so his eyes will match. Matima says he's grateful to both his guardian angel and a great doctor. Of course, I thank you, man. You're very welcome. Thank you every day. Thank you, man. Thank you I personally really appreciate it. That. And applause for Dr. Erdy there for being so passionate, making this operation happen. Matima, by the way, is writing a thank you note to the iBank to pass on to the family who donated that um, cornea.